Hi guys, it's That Sweet Simmer. Welcome back to part 11 of Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. And in the last part, we had Miss Phoebe Thompson right here. I am so excited, and we decorated her room and everything already, so she's all set to go. Right now, Alan is at work, and he might get a promotion today, so he's just going to continue to chat with his partner and get that relationship up a bit. Oh yeah, I installed the story, the story progression mod, so we will accept all these thingies. One's coming. Hold on. <laughs> uh, no. Okay, so we'll just get into the gameplay. So Phoebe is pretty darn hungry, so we will... Yeah, she's just hungry. We'll feed her. I guess we'll feed her. <laughs> uh, okay, so anyways, no. You're gonna feed your daughter before... And then you're gonna go ahead and put her in her crib. And actually with this story progression mod, I have to do this really quickly at City Hall. Um, NRAS story progression. Um, just so that I won't get notifications when stuff happens and such and yeah. Cool. Alrighty. <laughs> So, I hope you guys all had a really Merry Christmas. I know I did. I'm so happy with everything that I got and just got to spend a, the bit, bit, bit. I can't talk. I'm sorry. Oops. Hold on. Sorry about that, guys. I was on the phone. <laughs> so, after she puts Phoebe in the crib. Hold on one second. Again, so, so sorry about that. So after she puts Miss Phoebe in the crib, she's going to come eat some autumn salad. And have we, we haven't taught Gavin to walk. And he actually ages up in three days. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, that's pretty exciting. So, yeah. <laughs> so he'll probably age up in the next part or something like that. And yeah, I really need to fix this kitchen, put some decorations in it, because it's so plain. Plain and boring. <laughs> Alright, so she's just going to eat that, and let's see how Molly's doing. Hey! I yelled like it was my own dog. After you do that, come scold her for being destructive. That's bad, puppy. And you... Okay. <laughs> Why is everything like glowing? It's been happening in my game lately. Like if you see there's like a little circle around the imaginary doll thing. Annoying imaginary doll. Okay, so he gets off of work at three, so we'll just we'll just wait. I was gonna skip, but no point. So Gavin and uh, Phoebe are actually going to grow up on the same day. Yeah, so they each grow up in three days. And she goes. <laughs> Sheba dog has passed. Okay. I don't care. <laughs> it was probably some dog that was on our lawn or something. I don't, I don't know. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, that's cute. That's, that's cute. <laughs> well, why don't you... What is this? What is this? That is a freaky little gnome, and we're gonna sell it. Yeah. <laughs> um, come clean this up. And stuff like that. Maybe we'll invite one of her friends over? Hmm, why not? <laughs> and Gavin's about to get off of work, and I'm pretty sure he's gonna get a promotion. Yep, he's gonna get a promotion. And he's gonna have to actually, um, he's gonna have to actually go question somebody because he needs to do reports and stuff. So it says, congratulations, Alan's impressive performance has earned him a promotion to lieutenant, as well as a bonus of 860 simoleons. And I'm not gonna read that. But now he gets $80 an hour and works from 9 to 3, so same hours, pretty much. And yeah. Uh, Olivia doesn't go back to work until five days and 18 hours. So she'll go back one, two, three, four, Monday. She'll go back Monday, but the 
problem is, is I'm planning on having them have more kids. Ah. Don't, I don't know. Um, you, mister, you can come eat something. I have some leftover fried peanut butter, bur 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 butter and banana sandwich. <laughs> that was weird. And then he'll head to the festival to question some sims and report on them. And yeah. <laughs> So, I wonder what hair color she has. That's what I'm really curious about. Like, I wish I could find, like, a mod that can see their hair color. Maybe her eyebrows? <laughs> no, I can't really tell. I kind of hope she looks like her mom. I don't know, just because Gavin looks like his dad and stuff like that. So, what can she do? No, I'm not going to turn that on. Actually, we're going to sell this because we don't need it anymore. Um... What can we do? Why don't we put up a Christmas tree, actually? I just... God! <laughs> Why don't we put up a tree? Mm. I have custom content trees and stuff, so I want to check that out first. Before I go to the normal basic tree. No. Um. Let's see. I'm looking because I, I don't know where they are. Uh, here somewhere. Here's one that you can decorate yourself with ornaments I have, but I'm not gonna do that. And then we have this one. I kind of like that one a lot. Oh wow. Except I do want the one that lights up. So I think we're just gonna go with the store Christmas tree and get it in just a normal color. Yep, that's good. Alrighty, so now I'm gonna have her, what do I wanna have you do? What can you do? You're useless, I'm kidding. <laughs> Let's have her clean up around the house. So come make the bed and, um. Actually, why don't you come teach Gavin to walk? Cause now you guys are both kind of in a good mood and Except he's gonna pee soon. So actually teach him to potty. Potty train him. <clears throat> please don't piss yourself before we do this. Please, please, please. Cause sometimes I'll do it and then they'll piss themselves and not part of. Okay, we're good. I think this is gonna be the last time. Oh! Yay! Thank goodness, Gavin was just potty trained and just in time too. So why don't you actually just teach him to walk right now? Soon, yeah. <laughs> baby. This is a good baby. Usually my babies like cry every five minutes. So Alan is on his way to the summer festival or the winter festival. He's here, I think. Yeah, he's gonna come talk to some Sims. So we'll finally introduce ourselves. Okay, that was a glitch. <laughs> Can you come introduce yourself, please? Austin Gurley. Crimble. He's girly. On. <laughs> We're gonna just be nice to him and stuff. Ask about his career. Ask about his career. Um... Chakabra, and then we'll question him. So he's a singer. That's he doesn't look like a singer. <laughs> he wants to host. No. <laughs> special agent. Is what he is. So he got a science medicine degree. He doesn't care, really. He just want to question me. And he wants to snowboard, so we'll let him do that. And we'll come back over here to Olivia and Phoebe and Gavin. Because she's crying. Hold on, I just want to see how far along they are. Can I see? Can I see? Can I see? Can, can, can I see? Wow. Oh yeah, they're not that far along, so we're just gonna stop and she'll use the restroom real quick. And Phoebe is just pretty lonely. 
but we'll get to you in a sec after we use the restroom. <laughs> Now you can come give her a bottle, play with her, and snuggle her, and we will just head back over to Alan, and he is questioning him right now, so he's letting us. That's good. Okay, so we learned he's a genius, and we learned that he's a loser. Okay, then. We'll just head home and do our report on him and stuff. Okay. <laughs> so once she is done with that, we will just continue. What is wrong with you? She's probably gonna use or uh, go to the bathroom soon. So we'll just stick in here and we will go there again. <laughs> Until she uses the bathroom in her pants. Which will be pretty soon in a second. <laughs> I just wanted to tell you guys, I'm uploading a current household tomorrow. Yeah, I'm uploading a current household tomorrow. Which is exciting. So we'll put Phoebe in the crib. And Alan, you need to put him down and just go to sleep because you do. Oh no, tomorrow's snowflake day, so maybe we'll throw a party or something and have some fun. <laughs> okay, so Gavin is getting kind of hungry. Why did you put him in his crib? He has to eat. Erg. The ignorance. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and put him on the floor and. She's so close to 30,000, so I might actually buy the inheritance again, just so we could decorate around the house, because the house is pretty plain and stuff, so I think once she gets 30,000, we will get the inheritance, maybe. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and skip until the morning. Alrighty guys, so Olivia is the first to wake up on Snowflake Day, which is kind of cool because we just had Christmas. Anyways, she's going to come give Phoebe a bottle, play with her, and snuggle her because she is in a bad mood. And when Alan wakes up, which is now, he's going to come feed Gavin on the floor. No, that's not what he needs. <laughs> what am I doing? Um, I hope that didn't wake him up. No, it didn't wake him up. So, why don't you come down here and have some breakfast? Why don't you have some pancakes? And you, uh, after you do that, you'll come have some pancakes as well. And, yeah, so, I actually think Olivia is almost there. Um, we'll just have her throw a snowflake party or a... Um, what we call it? A gift giving party, and she will be there, and I will decorate the house. So yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. So once okay, she's almost done. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> and I'm gonna give them a makeover as soon as spring starts. So yeah, I'll make them look more parent like. Um, so we'll clean that up and go take a shower. Actually, no, you're going to have to come here and bathe Gavin because he is thinky. And you can undo that. And Olivia, she is stinky as well. So why don't you, after you're done with that, throw a party. And it will be a gift-giving party because it's a good way to get money. <laughs> Alright. Is it already dirty again? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm hallucinating, guys. I'm hallucinating. <laughs> so, it's going to be a... So sorry. Gift-giving party. It'll start at 4 p.m. And it will be casual attire and we'll invite Emily 
Tony, Mandy, Mason, Lacey, Lola, Garrett, oops, Garrett, Rob, Tiffany, and then we will invite Colette Floyd, and I think we know her husband. We're not going to invite Emily. We'll invite Brock Walterman because that is their kid. And yeah, so the gift giving party will start at four. And now she has enough for the inheritance. We so we're going to actually get it right now. And I am actually going to go ahead and decorate the house a little bit, and I will get back to you guys in a sec. Alrighty, so I didn't do as much as I thought I was going to. I really just added decor. So, I did a lot to the kitchen, actually. That's probably the one that I actually did the most. I put some things around the stove. This is, like, all, like, custom content, except for, like, these two. Um, it's a cooking book, which I thought was really cute to add next to the stove, because why not? Um, some kitchen essentials, I guess it's, like, tomatoes, olives noodles I don't know and then some spoons and some pans and knives to stab the burglars I'm kidding I'm totally kidding um, a coffee maker I added the wood fire oven and why can't we use it why I'll have to figure that out later um and then a different microwave more decorations and a little thing to fill in the space in this wall because I had no idea what to do. And yeah, that's that. And I added a little apron, so cute. And then right here I added a picture frame and stuff. I actually want to see if we have any photos. Do you have any photos? No. So they're going to have to take pictures and we'll put it in the frame whenever. And then um, I didn't really do much to this except add that, and in this room I just added a little fireplace decoration, and that's basically it. And then I bought them a car. I bought them the 2012 Ford Focus, Ford Focus 5 door. I think this is from the store, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's from the store. I don't know. I have a lot of custom content cars, and I'm pretty sure I have the Ford Focus um, that's custom content, so I don't really know whether that's custom content or store content. So, yeah. yeah. And then I didn't do anything upstairs. I thought I was going to do a lot more, but I kind of just want to save their money so that they have money to do stuff with kids, and yeah. So... Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Not a lot happened in this part. Just, um, just, uh, doing some normal household things. So, here's a big close-up of Olivia. <laughs> um, in the next part, we will have our Snowflake Day gift-giving party. And I think Gavin and Phoebe will grow up in the next part, hopefully. Maybe, maybe not. I don't really know. So, anyways, I'll see you guys then. Don't forget to check out the links below. Thumbs up the video if you liked it. And subscribe for more Let's Plays. Bye, guys.